Right, but the wind is whipping on Pine Island tonight. Wind, the big story there. This video from St. James City shows the rain coming down. It was coming down pretty hard earlier, and the good news is we are still not seeing flooding in that area tonight. NBC2's team coverage of Hurricane Elsa continues with Gage Golding live in St. James City. Yeah, right now, I wish you would have came to me about 30 seconds ago because this rain coming literally out of nowhere. Uh, 30 seconds ago, it was just windy, but now it's very rainy. But I want to show you where we're standing right now. Uh, we're in the water. Uh, this is off the southernest most point of St. James City on Pine Island. And I want, you can't really see because it's dark out. But way back there where the waves are crashing, probably about 30 yards back, is where we were earlier today. I mean, we believe our producers have some video of that in the, the studio. Can we punch that uh, video up earlier? That way we can give you a perspective of what everything looked like. Uh, and that's, that's what we were dealing with earlier. That wind, uh, excuse me, the storm surge, that negative storm surge pushing that water, kind of sucking it back into the gulf, if you will. And that's what we were seeing. And I caught up with a, a local Pine Islander, if you will, who says he's never seen anything like this before. Have you ever seen the water this low before? Um, it was worse during Irma when the uh, entire canals went empty and boats were sitting on the ground and falling off of lifts. It was kind of a little bit more exciting. But uh, this is probably about a foot or two below normal low tide. You concerned about safety at all? I am not. Um, I'm, I'm here just exploring. Got a little wetter than I thought I would in this interview. But I mean, just, just really just poking around, checking on friends and their boats who are out of town. Okay, talking about safety, when we talk about wind, uh, let's show our live truck right now. Can you see the rain? Can you see the rain moving sideways? That kind of wind can cause things like this. Look at the ground right now. This actually is a road sign. I'm trying to pick it up. And I did this in a social media video. It actually was pulled right from the ground. And if I try to pick it up, I can't move it the whole way back up because the wind is so strong moving in. But these items right here can become projectiles. This is what can be dangerous and can cause uh, an accident to go through a home. We're going to try to put this down safely here. So these are the things we're working with tonight. And if you thought Elsa, the Hurricane Elsa is over, I got news for you. It's still here on Pine Island. It's still here in St. James City. Toss back to you guys in the station.